Concerns are rising that vaccine supply in Korea may be hampered if the U.S. decides to provide booster shots. Health authorities are considering securing more vaccines in the second half of the year, but this could prove to be difficult. With U.S. health authorities considering providing booster shots to Americans, concerns are rising that vaccine shortages in Korea could become worse. Health authorities say they will monitor the situation and discuss it later. People who participated in overseas clinical trials when the vaccines were just developed will have been immunized for one year this coming summer or fall. That's when data on their antibodies and whether they need booster shots will likely be available. Preparation is needed for inoculating more people in the coming months, including pregnant women and children younger than 18. So far, the Korean government has signed deals for purchasing 79 million doses. Of those, 1.8 million have been already imported. More than 7.2 million doses will come in the second half of the year. Most of the remaining doses will likely be brought after the third quarter. Experts have called on authorities to contact vaccine manufacturers such as Pfizer and Moderna to secure more doses. This is because it would be difficult for vaccine makers that have just come onto the scene to suddenly develop shots that can fight new COVID-19 variants. 기존의 백신 접종을 위해서 확보하던 백신에 수급하고 많이 다르진 않아요. 결국 기존에 이미 개발하고 있는 회사들이 추가 원샷의 형태로 개발을 하게 될 가능성이 높고요. Health authorities say they are reviewing which vaccines to buy and in what quantities based on booster shots, cross vaccinations and virus variants.